go first or shall I? Uh, either way is fine with me. <laughs> Hi, I'm Alan Muirhead, and I'm Nick Thomas, and together with Carol Mosen and John W. Barker, we are the hosts of Musica Antiqua, which airs from uh, 8 o'clock to 11 o'clock every Sunday morning, and it's a presentation of uh, medieval renaissance and unusual Baroque music that you wouldn't hear anywhere else on the dial. Um, something that, that might or would surprise listeners about me, perhaps, is I grew up mostly in rural Texas, and I still have a taste for squirrel. Um, preferably with, um, uh, preferably with uh, dumplings is uh, the best way to eat it. Mm -hmm. And I guess uh, a potentially surprising part of my background is that I actually studied to be a chemist and um, for many years did research making ultimately the black and white films that Polaroid sold. So we made the part that you threw away. <laughs> and you had a postdoc, I think, at my alma mater. Yes, we were Back down in, in we were down in Houston at Rice. I didn't realize you had gone to Rice. Yeah. When my wife and I moved back to Madison about 12 years ago, um, one of the first things we discovered was W O R T and especially the early music because we've been interested in early music for ever. And uh, I'm involved with the Madison Early Music Festival, but was glad to discover Wart and then discovered Musica Antiqua and found that I could contribute to this wonderful program by sharing my record collection and my interest in the music and hopefully provide something to people that they would not find anywhere else on the radio dial. And then one day we were delighted to have this person come in. <laughs> uh, at that point I lived up the street on the 500 block of Doty and uh, eventually after a few months living in Madison I made the connection between um, the, the show music Antiqua, which I had heard occasionally, um, or had seen online, I think, and that funny-looking building just down the street, which I didn't realize until a few months after I moved, uh, was in fact the radio station uh, whence it originated. So I wandered in um, on, on some weekday and met Glenn immediately, and he said, oh, uh, let me introduce you um, <laughs> uh, to, to Alan and Carol. Um, and John too, of course, and then they, they were kind enough to let me join. So. Or eager enough to suck him in, I guess is right. And I'm sure John and Carol, who unfortunately couldn't be here today, they have similar stories of, uh, I know Carol has been involved in this program for many years, decades even, um, with her love of early music, and of course John W. Barker is a fixture in the Madison music and early music scene, and. Uh, as I've heard one person say, he has forgotten more than anybody else knows about uh, early music. And so all of us bring our, our love for this beautiful, beautiful music and hope that our listeners love it as well. I think that we both, along with Carol and John, would like to uh, extend our thanks to those of you in the Madison community and uh, listeners outside of the Madison area um, who make this show possible for us uh, to share our love of the repertoire and uh, for everybody else who listens on a weekly basis. Yes, yeah, the station wouldn't be here without your support and we thank you for that.